Mirror's Edge, I would say, revolves around this young woman named Faith. She's a runner, and she belongs to a community of runners, and they are parkour artists and martial artists. The main themes of the game revolve around individualism and freedom versus control and collectivism. Creating a better gaming experience is about fueling the passion of the player. With NVIDIA's new hardware, we at DICE basically saw the opportunity to create something new, to create something better. Hyper settings is that. It is what enables the players to get to the next visual fidelity level. And you can do that by using NVIDIA's 1080. The NVIDIA's Ansel brings us one of the core pillars of Mirror's Edge Catalyst, which is UGC, user-generated content. Ansel supports full camera motion. You can pan, tilt, and roll. So you can basically frame your shot the way you want it. Ansel brings you the possibility to create 360 degree images, and you can share those on Facebook. By using a mobile phone, you can look around and see actually how the city looks like. And bringing this technology to virtual reality, you can actually step into the city of glass and be totally immersed in ordinary games, when you just take a screenshot, you're basically done. If you want to do any changes, you can crop the image. With Ansel, you'll have more control. You can actually control the lens of the camera, which enables you to set field of view. By doing that, you can create much, much more quality in your screenshots. With post-processing filters, you can change the image after the fact that's been taken. So you can choose how you want the picture to look. I'm very proud of what we built. It's a beautiful city and has a lot of variety to it. I think with Ansel, the possibility for them to showcase it to others, I think is amazing. With Hyper and Ansel, this is looking even more stunning.